and watching these clips of me working out is making me cringe so bad it's so it's just awful like i'm putting in no effort let's not even talk about my pajamas <laughs> i'm gonna leave them in just for your entertainment but yeah i just wanted to say i know that that is a terrible workout but the thought was there it's the thought that counts isn't it you know like i tried it's better than nothing so yeah I try to do that at least two to three times a week and they're literally only like 10, 20 minute little workouts that I find on YouTube. But yeah, clearly I just wasn't feeling it that day. So anyway, enjoy the rest of the video. <laughs> shower and i've got dressed um i've just put on this little like it looks like a cold but it's actually not this goes with a pair of joggers but i just love wearing these um baggy flared trousers when i'm just lounging about and working from home because they're so comfy um this is definitely a go-to outfit that i would <laughs> normally wear working from home i'm gonna throw a jumper on though because this house is freaking freezing well i definitely look scruffier now especially considering this jumper is incredibly creased <laughs> I forgot to say where everything is from. Um, this jumper's misguided. This little top underneath is misguided as well. And it has like matching jogging bottoms. And then these trousers are from ASOS. I don't typically wear makeup during the week. Um, as no one's really gonna see me. I'd like to give my skin a bit of a break. So um, I just use this Cetaphil cleanser. Pump a little bit on my hand. Face. And then I just use the salad water to kind of rinse it off. Many of us are lazy and can't afford to go to the sea. Also, I like this anyway. Just make sure all my mascara is off so I don't look like I've got bags under my eyes. Um, that is pretty much it. I'm just going to put some moisturiser on. Again, set a fill daily moisturiser. The morning i try and keep it quite simple if i was going into the office i obviously would put makeup on um but when i'm just at home i just like to be au natural so that is pretty much it obviously i look start to look a bit more presentable throughout the day when my face de-puffs <laughs> And then I'm just going to brush my hair out because there should still be some curls in it from the weekend. I'm just going to use like this makeshift tangle teaser kind of thing. Sorry, my battery just died and I don't have a spare one yet. So I quickly charged it. But uh, I'm not sure how long it's going to last. Um, I just brushed my hair out. It looks like this. It's still got the curls from um, the weekend. I did put a bit of dry shampoo in it just to vamp up my roots. Because they were looking a bit greasy. And then I also just ran this Jamaican styling lotion through the curls. Um, just because they were a little bit frizzy. So it just kind of brings a bit of hydration back to them so yeah that is me looking much more presentable um last thing on my morning to-do list is to make my breakfast essentially and then i start work at about eight so it's currently half past seven so um 
I've got about half an hour to make and eat my breakfast. I mean, sometimes I bring it to my desk anyway and start eating um, while I log on. But yeah, I think I'm gonna make a smoothie and granola bowl. I made this on my what I eat in a day video. Um, so I might not like really show you how I'm gonna make it again because if you wanna see it, you can just go watch that video. But yeah, I've been really into them at the moment. They just make me feel really refreshed. Um, and I don't tend to eat much fruit and veg throughout the day. So to like shove it all in my breakfast is ideal for me, to be honest. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go do that now and I'll see you downstairs. I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna put in my smoothie um, because I mean, it's pretty much the same as the last time, but there's a few differences. So some frozen summer fruits and then some frozen strawberries and blueberries. And then I put a little bit of orange juice and normally some water, maybe some milk or some yogurt, but today I'm just gonna use orange juice and water. And then on the top, I've been using this Belgian chocolate praline granola, which is really nice. That's just from Sainsbury's. And then I do put a few chia seeds on the top and some milled mixed seeds. I'm not gonna lie, I have no idea what they do. I have no idea the benefits of them. So here's my breakfast in all its glory. I just chopped up like a couple of strawberries. Um, I didn't want too many because obviously um, there's already quite a lot in the actual smoothie, granola, and then I just filled this up with fresh tap water. I am at my desk now, so I'm gonna end the video out here. I'm just gonna sit here and eat my breakfast, try and guzzle down this water. Um, and that is practically my morning. I sit here now until my lunch. So I don't think it would be very interesting to show you anymore. But if you would be interested in seeing a full day in my life, then comment down below and let me know because I can definitely do that for you. Um, but for today, that is everything. I hope you enjoyed this probably pretty short video, um, but a little insight into my life. So yeah, I hope everyone has a really good week. Don't forget to like this video if you enjoyed and subscribe down below if you want to see more. And I'll see you again soon. Bye. You get it by now. Tell me what you learned in grade school. Give it to me like you want it. Did you forget that golden rule? What is our love at one sided? It should really be given, take.